Thank you to the amazing Up in the Air Life team for making this Singapore experience a reality. And special shout out to my brother, Mr. Anabolic Beats, for always providing me with dope music to go along with my videos. That's it. On the way to Singapore. I was super excited to get to the world famous Marina Bay Sands. They say if you're going to Singapore, you got to stay at the Marina Bay Sands. Singapore is serious about their green thumb. They had a whole team that made sure that it was a different floor arrangement every day as soon as you come into the building. The rooms were plush, had remote control, everything. But the best part about the room, of course, was the view that overlooked Gardens by the Bay. You can see the whole city on one side and the bay by the other side. And at night, you could watch the light show right from your balcony. They had two light shows every night at 745 and 845. My focus that evening was to get up to the world's largest rooftop infinity pool while the sun was setting. The sunset view was amazing, but it's a totally different look at night. World famous chili crab is what everybody was raving about. So we tried it at a few different places, but I must say Jumbo's was my favorite out of all the places I tried. The reality of Singapore is like, if you just wanted to make food videos, it's so much food. You could just strictly make food videos. And it's all sorts of food, all different types of food. It's not just one type of food. Singapore's subway system was $2. For $2, you can go damn near any place in Singapore. So I took advantage of it. 
This is the cleanest subway I ever got on in my entire life. Taking it down to Chinatown. My my this now center is each one by one so by one by one. Okay. By one by one. Can I see? Yeah. Oh, that's pretty. No hugging in public, no kissing in public, no beeping your horn, no spitting, no littering. Singapore don't play. You cannot come to Singapore without going to one of the Hawker stations, the Hawker centers, a Hawker food tour, Hawker something. It's a must do experience. I think this is the best coffee I've ever tasted in my life. You know what else is weird? This is strictly my opinion. They eat all day long, but you never see any overweight people. I don't know if it's the type of food they eat or what, but they eat all day long. I don't understand it. There's so many different varieties of food to choose from. It's unlimited. It's crazy. This is the Michelin star awarded chicken. I made it a point to go walking every day. It's just so much to see there. And so many people to meet. Everybody's so nice and so welcoming. I even got to meet the dance squad. They would practice every morning trying to get their moves together. Almost there, we're getting closer. We walk from way over there. Finally made it to the Mer Lion, which is half mermaid, half lion. It's one of the most famous landmarks in Singapore. It's huge. So whenever you're walking, it looks like it's close, but it's really far as hell. So it's a ginormous mall connected to Marina Bay Sands. I believe it's called Shops by the Bay. If I am designer is your thing, look no further. This is your spot. You will be in heaven. Everything is designer. Uh, they have great prices, great customer service, and any designer that you can think of is in this mall. It's like four or five floors. One of the biggest malls I've ever seen. It's ridiculous. They also have Louis Vuitton Island. You have to make an appointment to come in there. And it's just crazy. But everybody I see go in comes out with a million bags and gigantic smiles on their faces. If you appreciate high-end cars, you will truly love the car scene down here. Some of the craziest limited edition cars you will ever see. I'm talking teenagers driving Bentleys, Ferraris. It's just crazy. You can't come here without visiting Gardens by the Bay. Absolutely beautiful. You need an entire day just to appreciate everything inside of here. Now I will tell you to make sure you go to the bathroom before you get here, because I don't know how this will work out for you.
Here's another misconception. Because these trees are so big, you don't realize how high they are until you actually walk up on the top. And this bridge moves. This has been an amazing experience. Singapore is definitely the cleanest place I've ever been to, the most organized place I've been to, and one of the wealthiest places I've ever visited. This video doesn't even scratch the surface of everything I did while I was here. It's worth the 20 hour flight. Thank you guys for viewing. If you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe and stay tuned for more epic adventures.